been a long time. Almost ten years since Joe and I killed Jaws and saved the city. Now people just call it the incident. That marked the downfall of our town. Global news coverage followed the entire story. They showed the city at fault for the entire thing. Loss of lives, shock attacks, everything. We're just starting to recover. And we want to forget about the past. Six months ago, it was an emergency call on a stormy night. Joe was sure the shocks had returned. It was a solo mission, and he wouldn't let me come. We searched every day, but soon, people gave up hope. They're having his funeral today, but I will stop at nothing to figure out what really happened out on that stormy night. I wonder, has Jaws really returned? So today's Joe's funeral. Can't believe it either. They're just gonna give up on him like that. It's ridiculous. All he's done for this town. But I guess some people just gotta move on. Maybe we'll figure out what happened. I got something cool to show you guys. Something a little different. Finally moved out here to Amidity Island. Got a spot all on my own. Moved out from my parents now that I'm working here full time as lieutenant. Joe was lieutenant as well. Now it's just me. And hey, you know, I can build this whole place. Do whatever I want. This can be my house. It can be a cabin, a log cabin, or well, maybe, maybe I could shape it like a burger. That'd be pretty cool, huh? Well, Thought I'd show you guys this before I go into work. I'm a little bit late here, but we're just gonna have to take my old Shelby and whip her around. Here we go. Let's give it her a good old goosin'. Pedal to the metal. Here we go. Time for some work. We don't get too many uh, crimes. Oh, duck. Crimes out here in the Midi Islands. Pretty quiet. Okay, blinker. Oh, gee. I. Miss Flandergan. I think it's Flandergan. Flanagan, get it, get out of the road. Uh, let me help you here, Miss Flanagan. Please, come on. There's people driving. I was, I was gonna take you out. There's no stop walk here. You're lucky I'm not on duty. I'd book you and be in jail for the night. I won't leave this place till I find my necklace. That gosh darn thing fell off. It's the last thing I have but my husband Quint. Oh, I, was it Quint? Wait, hold on, Quint. That's... That's the fisherman. One who helped us. We were never able to find him. We looked for days. Weeks. Months, even. He was nowhere to be found. He was a hero. I best not mention it. The incident. They don't like to talk about it around here. Don't wor worry, Miss Flan... Mrs. F Miss... Is it Mrs. or Miss? I don't... Flandergan. Miss... F Mrs. Flandergan. I'm gonna look around here. It's gotta be around somewhere. Maybe you just misplaced it. Alright, let's give her a good old check. The owls have been invading the town lately. <laughs> Snakes, too. Wait, no, you're just her pet. Oh! You're Flandergan's pet? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to look at your, you in the eye. Hold on. Mrs. Flandergan! I, you, you left it in the bushes! Come on! What are you doing here? Did, did I get it? Oh! I hate those dang snakes! Miss Flander, you gotta get that thing out of here. Okay, the necklace is right there. We just gotta go real quick. Ooh, ooh, scoop! And another day, another saved life. Miss Flandergan! Oh, Mrs. Flandergan, I don't know what the which it is. Okay, just here, come with me. Let's get you out of the middle of the road. I'm trying to work here. and. I think this should be a good spot. Come on. No, enough. I found your necklace. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave you here. Mrs. Flanagan, I'll talk to you later. I gotta go to work. Oh, God. Mrs. Flanagan, 
Well, there's a lot changing here in the Midi Island. We got a lot of uh, construction going on here. There's a new guy. Oh, duck crossing. Let me cross real quick. Which side? Uh, you coming or you going? All right. There's a new guy here. He's a contractor. He's been building a ton of places, selling them, making a quick buck. I might have to do that myself. But guys, being a lieutenant, okay, nobody coming across the stop walk. Being a lieutenant, it's got some special perks. Like my own special parking. Right near the front. Only the police trucks get to park here. And my special vehicle. And oh, a little it's just, I'm still learning how to park this thing. Perfection! Look at that! That's not too shabby of a job. Okay, st stop, Shelby. Uh, don't hit the curb. Oh, oh, God. It's, I'm going to have to get that fixed. Oh, it's scratched a little bit. But it says reserve Maverick. I, I'm, I swear. What's, what's going on here? Is this a gang member? What's up here? This gangster was caught robbing the new people moving in. People over there? Hey, knock it off, punk! We run these streets. We don't want any gangsters. You have to go through some community service. And you have to apologize to them for stealing their stuff. This is a tough one to crack. Maybe we'll get him. Get him in there, Jimmy Job. What's his name? Ralph. Jimmy Job's your brother. Literally, there's triplets here working here. Whoa, what's going on here, everybody? Everybody just relax. Every, oh my God, lifeguard Maggie. What? This is Flanagan. Oh, wait, maybe that's your twin sister. I don't know. All right, what, what's what seems to be the problem? We're tired of all these college kids coming for a spring break, trashing the beach. The fish are dying from this trash floating into the ocean. Hmm. That's a tough one, guys. That's a tough one. Well, the city makes the most money during this time. Spring break. But it does leave some trash. We'll have to work together. Lifeguard Maggie, will you be able to uh, assist in the pickup with your team? I can't control all these people. Lifeguard staff is only so big. Hmm. You know what? Here we go. I got a solution. Why don't we put a bounty... And if you find somebody littering and they leave it, you get a reward. Obviously, it would be coupons. We don't really have cash to give us the budget. Pretty tight here at the uh, the police station, but uh, it'll have to do. Anywhere you want in the town, it'll be a voucher. All right. Um. Oh, what's going on there? Uh, one eye. Find anything good out there? Well, my new pad looks pretty freaking sweet, man. I mean, well, I slept out in a tent last night, but hey, it looks pretty good. I'm not living with my parents. I don't have my nephew who's screaming all the time, playing video games. He's older now. He's got to be like, what, 16? He's at one of those age. He's rebelling. Oh, there's Jimmy Job. Win brother. There's Ralphie Poo. He's, I don't. We don't know his name. He's the third one. They all got a bit of a stare. It's really weird. But um, is there anything going on today? Cause I really want to get my hands dirty, take care of some uh, gang member scum if we got any out there. Did you hear? The build site was broken into last night. Apparently, somebody vandalized the entire place and ruined ten thousand dollars worth of building supplies. That's ridiculous. Oh my, I did not hear about that at all. I was just driving past there. I'll, I'll have to check it out. I'll investigate that. Don't don't want anybody to get that. I'll copy that, everybody. Wait, I don't have my walkie. Where's my walkie? Who has my walkie? I gotta get another one. Well, welcome to the police station. Home of all the criminals of Amity Island. Now look at that one. He's all brow. Thinks he's better than us. I think that's a water Malone in there. I'm not too sure how he got here, but oh, there's another gang member. Gangs have been uh, up and coming thing as we build into a city. Not much we can do though. That for lock them up here. You hear that, gang members? 
You won't get away with your crimes. I'll make sure I take care of you. Full extent of the law. Alright, so let me show you the rest of this joint. We got a lot of cool stuff here. What's going on in there? Hmm, that's one of the new officers. She's probably lost. Oh my god, Amanda, look at that. That's a freaking sick. Is that a desert eagle? That's a golden desert eagle. Jeez. Okay, well. Hey guys, well, I don't got a girlfriend yet, but, uh, Amanda over there, I think she digs me. I don't know, what do you guys think? But, I'm, yeah, she's not really my type. She's kind of, uh, not crazy enough. Ooh, look at you here, we got a Remington. This thing's got a bit of a kick to it. We also got, uh, some state-of-the-art technology. This is for any riots, and also, I shouldn't say this too loudly, in case. Is another incident. But that's just, uh, in theory, you know. Nobody else here believes the incident will ever return. Let's, uh, look for one of those walkies. Uh, the scientist who did engineer this, he actually helped, uh, with the incident. We managed to pick him up from a lab and hire him full time here at the police station. He engineers a few things. There we go. Here's my walkie. A wireless analyzer. He, does, he calls things the weirdest things, you know? All right, one, two, three, and it's the password. Oh, what's going on there? That's one of the other lieutenants. Hey man, how's it going, Jim? I'll be over at the funeral today. Can't believe it's been six months since we he went missing. I know, man, six months, but thank you. Thanks for coming. Oh, I probably should stop in and say hello to uh, Nugget in here. This was Joe's cousin, long lost cousin. But He's, uh, he, he's hard to get along with, but uh, we'll try here. Hey, Nugget, me, Maverick. What's going on? Ooh, should have knocked. Uh, here we go, do knocks. Hey, sorry about that. Just wanted to say I'm sorry about your brother. Joe, he's, he's not going to be forgotten. We're going to keep searching for him, or at least I am. Thanks, kid. I am busy here, though. Let me be. <laughs> All right, buddy. My kid, what the heck? He's always got that type of lingo. He's the detective here. He thinks he's all hot stuff, but hey. Chief, buddy, what are you doing? Uh, you gonna make it out to the funeral today? I mean, I don't know what we're gonna do without Joe. It, it doesn't feel the same without him here. I mean, we got Detective Nugget, one other lieutenant. Uh, his name escapes me, but Chief, what's the deal here? I don't know how we're gonna fill his shoes. But you're getting a rookie tomorrow, Maverick. You best be nice to this one, you hear? I. <sighs> See, guys. Since I've been a uh, solo here, I've had a few different partners. None of them worked out, you know. They they're not the ones for me. They we just didn't gel well. They they smelled bad. They, they, they had a lot of issues. <sighs> be nice to them. Whatever. Well, get a good look at the entire city. Make sure nothing's going on. We also gotta visit the, uh, build site. The contractor guy, he's not the nicest. But, uh, he does get some stuff done. We'll have to see what's going on. So far, the city looks pretty clean to me. I've got most of the gangsters, and most of it's just college kids. You know, they'll drink underage, and we'll be able to book them up. Remember, kids, do not drink. It is not good at all. We should catch them up on that water tower over there. They think they're sneaky, but hey, they're on public property. And we also got a camera installed over there, so yeah, they're always going to get caught. Well, I think let's go down. I haven't been able to fly the Seahawk just yet, but I will get my chance. I told you, we're being infested with snakes. This place, oh my, he's in the cockpit. I hate snakes. I'm gonna burn them all. Let none of them live. That's a bit intense. Well, I'm gonna go get some food real quick. Chief, I'll uh, check you out. I've been here all day. I was just all morning, just you know, working really hard and stuff. I, I gotta get some. And I'm also gonna check out that uh, scene over at the uh, contractors. You can't hear me. Okay. Everything seems to be dandy here on the piers. Ooh. Who's that? Ow. Oh, I thought it was a siren. These owls, since the sirens are going for the boats and stuff, they get attracted here, and also, they like the food. 
We don't get many seagulls here, we just get owls, strangely enough. All right, citizens, how's it going, everybody? Hey, Roger, you got my stuff that I want? I need that breakfast burger. Give me with that bacon. Oh, and the chaws, don't forget the chaws, man. I need that chaws. Sorry, Maverick, it's past 10. You stopped serving breakfast. What do you mean it's past 10? I just got in a, okay, it's a little late. Uh, fine, whatever, what do you got? Let's see what that, uh, mm, chili, blood chili. Must be some hot stuff, hot dog, hot dog. Whoa, my God. Look at here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with some blood chili here. That didn't look as wicked good. Okay, let's try to eat this right up. Ooh, that's spicy. Woo, he's got a kick to it, man. Woo. Oh, look what it's doing to me. It's got a kick to it indeed. My face is turning blue. You guys gotta be careful for this chili. It's intense. Sorry. I just like to scare the college kids. Actually, this is really um, taking a toll on me. How long is this gonna last? 30 seconds? Alright. Maybe we can scare somebody else. Sneak up on this guy. It's unexpected. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, he's frozen. I scared him stiff. Sometimes they just don't uh, react. But hey, I got him. Look at that boat right there. That's my police boat. That one is the detective's. He's got a bigger boat. But hey, mine rides pretty good. He had to replace it since Joe, well, you know, never made it back. All right, let's go investigate that situation over there at the contractor's. Yeah, let's get this guy a good job. All right, let's peel out here. It's not working. Oh, I'm gonna start it. There we go. It started off. Time to peel out. Okay, let's go. Oh wait, I'm in the passenger seat. That's why it's not working. That's what I. That's in my hand. My ears. All right, here we go. Peeling out. This is working. Oh, and there we're off. Perfect. That wasn't too shabby. All right. Um. What's going on here? We'll pull right in here. Uh, parking spots? Well, we should be able to park right here. Alright, that's not too bad. Parking job. Whoa, careful now. What seems to be the problem over here, guys? I got a call, 1044.99. And you know the works. What's up? Right there's vandalizing. Doesn't seem like much is going on here. This is terrible. You guys are supposed to be watching the city. Look what they did. We have to shut down all day to clean this mess. You guys will pay for it. Yeah, right. The police will never pay for that. We got barely, no, that, we're not, we're not your own personal guards. What are you talking about? Jeez, I'll pass that information on to the chief. We'll be sure to never visit this place. Hmm. Looks like a graffiti job. I guess it's not, oh, it's a little bit bad. Leave or you will return. What does that even mean? Leave or he will return. Well, I don't know. But there's no way in heck the thief is gonna like that. I don't even know who had night duty, but this is, it couldn't have taken him that long. Okay, it seems like it, oh geez, there's more. Oh my God. All right, we can clean this mess up, no problem, real quick. What is he talking about all day? Yeah, right. All right, let's just get some axes here. What do we got? Uh, some ladders, maybe some scaffolding. That'll help us. All right, let's try to chop this stuff down real quick. Come on, this, yeah, see, this is an easy cleanup job. I'll just take this one out real quick. Nothing to worry about. Perfect. Oh, let's get one more right over here. Can we reach it? Oh, we might need some scaffolding. All right, get that scaffold. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, got a scaffold, perfect. And let's chop this one down. Oh, these guys, they're ridiculous. Thinking we're just their own personal maids, but they own pretty much 30% of the city. I could, we argue with them. I mean, they could tear this entire city down. They run the, inco the economy over here. So, it's always worrisome when they uh, have an issue because they might ask a lot from the police. But there's no way we could afford paying for this entire situation. If they were shut down for the entire day, that would cost so much. 
stuck doing the dirty work. You know what? All right. You know, I'll just have somebody come out later. All right. You know what? I'll have somebody come out later. They'll clean it up. Sorry about this. I hate sucking up to these losers. All right. I'll radio in. Yo, Jimmy! All right. Good, good, good. You're on. All right. Um, well... So you've got a bit of a problem here. Oh, there's a poop party! Oh, I don't know what's happening! Oh, there's a poop! Oh, oh, God. Oh, that was on radio. Uh, I was not on the toilet, Jim. Don't worry about that, Jimmy Bob. Uh, all right, so I just, something just came up. I don't know what it is. Uh, so there's a situation here. Indeed. Uh, vandalizing, there seems to be... And I reported about one, two, three, four, probably about seven different uh, graffiti spots. Looks like some pretty good damage. I don't know about 10,000, but they're looking to have us pay for it since we didn't uh, catch them. I mean, if it was only one, I would say, hey, the guy just got away real quick. You know, we can't patrol every area, but it's pretty bad. There's like, we messed up. We messed up. And uh, we're not going to be able to pay that. So. Probably get one of the new guys to come down here and clean it up. Just get like a shovel or a pooper scoop or something. Just clean it right off. It should be good. Over and out. Maverick out. All right, let me go tell the uh, contractor. Ooh, that foreman is a bit of a jerk. Hello? Oh, Mayor. Mayor Sabrina. What's going on here? Um, so, yeah, we're not really able to clean that mess up. Uh, right now, I guess, but, uh, somebody should be coming out pretty soon, maybe. I don't know. Can't you tell we're a little busy here? The mayor does not have all the time in the world to be interrupted by the likes of you. Right. This guy's a bit of a jerk. Mayor, Sabrina, what, what's up? Why, don't let him talk to me like that? He's right, Cody. We're just trying to figure out what to do after the event, recent events. Come on, we can't pay for that. You've already taken my bonus away. This is ridiculous. Come on, we can clean this up. We can make... <sighs> All right, Sabrina. <sighs> well, she's the new mayor, guys. And she's actually been running this town for 10 years since uh, the other guy got fired for making the beach stay open. But she's been doing a great job. Not too shabby, at least. Well, I, she sucks up to this guy way too much. If it was me and I was mayor, ooh, this guy would be kicked out of my town. Well, then my town would have no money. You know what? That's why I am a police officer. Lieutenant. Excuse me? Well, uh... I think I'm probably gonna head back to the police station, see if anything comes up. But there's only two more hours till uh, Joe's funeral. It's gonna be really a private one, not too many people are invited, so. We'll be able to see Joe's wife, you guys will be able to meet her. Should be pretty good. Uh, she's, she's kind of um, lost a bit. Don't let herself go. Yeah, that's the right words. Let herself go since uh, Joe's gone missing. <sighs> this is it. This is a. Uh... Joe's last hurrah. Can't go over there. Ridiculous, man. They just gave up. They gave up to him. What if I? What if I just went out there? What if I was there? Joe, this wouldn't have happened. Why would he just? Why wouldn't he let me go with them? <laughs> he thought Jaws was coming back. I told him, Joe. Joe, Jaws is never coming back. <laughs> He's. He wanted to go out in that storm and figure it out. He never returned. Why is he gotta be so stubborn? <sighs> Alright. Gotta do this thing. <sighs> Joe Buzz. He was tough cookie he always knew how to make humor out of a tough situation we thought we saw the last of Jaws well at least I did Joe always thought something was coming back 
He was determined to figure out what was going on with the sharks and why they never returned. I told them it was, it was just because they're just scared. They heard what happened here, but he didn't believe that. You gotta give him credit. He was determined. And he did what he loved. Protecting the people of Amidity Island. He went out on that night to figure out where that lost boat was. And he never returned. And in that, he left his lovely life and his wife, Angelica. Joe will be remembered in the mid of the island as a hero. And this gravestone, this monument, will be here forever to remember him. And Joe always wanted to be buried with some chicken nuggets. Oh. I went to KFC, and I got him some KFC nuggets in the popcorn chicken. <laughs> you know what, I'm not, I'll be doing this myself. They don't have a body to bury Joe Buzz in, but we will find a way. Oh God, gone forever, guys. We're almost done here. Let's just, uh, last two, last two pieces of dirt. Here's the coffin. Nobody in it. Couldn't even find the body. It never even washed up. Can't believe this. We dug him six feet deep. Time well, to move on, I guess. Ridiculous. He left his his lovely wife. There's nothing we can do now, though. Get some of this tombstone. Here it goes. We spelt here wrong. Oh, yep. No. Uh, I, I, I can't fix the spelling mistake. Here, I, the Joe Bus, Bus. I knew he would laugh at that. I think that's how it's meant to be. I'm gonna leave that spelling error right there. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna put the nuggets in with him. I think he'd want that in the afterlife. Let's just, um, toss the nuggets in there. Oh, that's it. Whoa. Uh, those iron coins are coming with me. Who put those iron coins in there? Is that my money? Well, I'm taking it with me, or whatever, or whatever money that was. Angelica, I'm so sorry for your loss. Go Buzz will be missed. Please, Cody, you're the only one that will fight to figure out what happened. Joe always knew Jaws would return. You know this is what happened. Cody, listen to those words. Jaws has returned. Your friend was eating my Jaws. Please, Cody. Angelica, I just know. <laughs> Jaws. Fine. You know what? I'll look for Jaws. I'll figure out if that's what happened. We'll slice Jaws open and see if Jaws it was really eaten by Jaws. That'll give us some closure. I won't rest every waking minute. Besides when I'm working at the police station because it's police town time. Uh, I'll be looking. Don't worry. Nugget, will you help me? Alright, Nugget. I kinda like that. We'll do some detective work together. What about you, Jim? I don't know if Dyes is still out there. There's only one way to figure out if he is. You won't get away with this, Jaws.